Now, this is the thing that I kind of hate is when um, someone goes on Fox News and they make the Fox News person look sane. Right? Well, but okay, but let me, and we'll talk about it afterward, Jimmy, but it's not right. just a question of making it look sane. I think, again, going back to Newtown, and I'm not giving Fox News all the credit in the world here, I'm talking about Chris Wallace. They realize, Anna Navarro, who is a Republican strategist, was on yesterday on Meet the Press. They realize that this has changed the conversation a little bit. So Anna Navarro was saying, you know what, we have to talk about universal background checks. We have to do them. Republicans have to do them. So people like Chris Wallace can say, you know, all right, we've crossed that threshold now. Let's keep having this conversation. So yeah, it's not a defense of Fox News, but it's, you're starting to see a couple of journalists from that side mm -hmm. say those things. Let's hear it. We ought to quit calling it right now a universal check. The real title ought to be the check on law-abiding people all over this country. And then let's talk about how it's going to work. They're going to take a failed system. If you're in Broken Bow, Nebraska, or if you're in Anselmo, Nebraska out there, and you're a hunter or you're a rancher, if I want to sell a, you a shotgun or something like that, we're going to, federal governments, we're going to have to go find a dealer or walk into a police station. Who's going to do the check? There's going to be fees. There's going to be paperwork. There's going to be law-abiding people caught up <laughs> in a bureaucratic nightmare. A bureaucratic. And there's going to be abuse in terms of prosecutions. And it's all going to affect only the law-abiding people. The criminals could care less. You know, I, I changed my mind. <laughs> I didn't know there were going to be fees and paperwork. Yeah. Then it's let's going not do to it. be yeah. a bureaucratic Guns nightmare. for everyone. Guns let's for not, everyone. I'm sorry. Fees, let's not paperwork. I didn't know that there was going to actually be a system in place to track this stuff. <laughs> yeah. If they're going to do that, then let's get rid of it. That's exactly what we want to do. That's this exactly is, the problem, is, the, is that the, you can sell your gun in the middle of bumfuck Nebraska, and there's no record of it. No one knows where that gun went. Right. Well, the NRA was planning a gun vending machine program nationwide, <laughs> and this gets in this cock blocks that. Yeah, it does. Uh, it, but it's a way time. around the paperwork. It puts a wrinkle in it. <laughs> that would have been a way around the paperwork. But this idea that somehow uh, that getting a gun would be like going to the DMV. Yeah. What's wrong with that? Well, actually, my, going to the DMV, if you make an appointment, you're in and out in 15 yeah. minutes. I mean, I, like, what, it, what, I mean, what's so bad so about that? You have that? to do that if you want to coach at the Y. <laughs> You know, so I don't understand why you you don't have to do it if you if you don't own a firearm. Well, let me say That's this: he's, he's given this scenario like so. If I'm out in the middle of Oshkosh, Stedapede, Nebraska, and I want to sell a gun to somebody, I gotta go then find a I thing. Gotta find a dealer. I gotta. So let me put it this way: so if I want to, I'm out in the middle of Nebraska, and I want to sell you my truck. You mean I gotta go get a title from the state, <laughs> and I gotta sell? I gotta write stuff down. Such There's a, gonna be fees involved. No one's yeah. gonna have guns. No if you one. Do that. No one will have trucks. No one will get, only the criminals will have trucks. Because yeah. they don't care about transfer titles and stuff like that. Uh, I don't know what that was. Uh, was a great was. Nebraska accent. I wish they would you. make getting rid of a truck easier, actually. That's <laughs> something I would really support because it is a pain in the ass. Yeah. You've been to CarMax, it takes a whole day. Yeah. I well, you should just be able to shoot the truck. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Dig a hole. Dig a hole. <laughs> Dig a hole. <laughs> that's what. That's what. That's how. There's a lot of holes in Wyoming full of Dick Cheney's problems. I'll tell you that. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you that. Um, so that was. So that's his example of like mm. you can't have these background checks. You can't have any kind of checks on it because it would involve paperwork and bureaucracy, which we have for everything that's important. Yeah. So let's look. look you know, this is fun. Let's play one more clip let's from him. Forgive me, sir, but you take something that is here and you say it's going to go all the way over there there's no indication i mean i can understand you're saying that's the threat but there's nothing that anyone in the administration has said that indicates they're going to have a universal registry and obamacare wasn't a tax until they needed it to be a tax well, well it was it. the supreme court that i mean said that. i don't think you can trust these they, they, i mean I, I, my gosh diane feinstein said if we could go, go door to door and pick them all up i'd do it so uh, he makes a brief, completely bullshit point. Chris Wallace <laughs> debunks him in real right. time. Yeah. He doesn't skip a beat. He keeps going. You can't trust these people. It wasn't them. It was like, yeah, these people you can't trust. Some diet five times. War off a duck's ass, this guy. Yeah. Facts and accurate information just right off his face. Nothing penetrates. Right. No. They're coming door to door, apparently. They're going to go door, door to, door to door and remove every gun. Yeah. My, well, I'm wondering, though, if, if, if they do go door to door, what happens if they find uh, someone who's illegal, like an alien and a gun? Do right. you deport the person and take the gun? I mean, it's a big bureaucracy. That's a bureaucracy. <laughs> that's a bureaucracy. Wow. <laughs>